King Charles will deliver his first public address since the Princess of Wales revealed her cancer diagnosis during a pre-recorded message to be broadcast at a royal Monday service in Worcester Cathedral on Thursday, led by the Queen. In his address, the monarch will emphasize the importance of friendship, particularly during challenging times, drawing inspiration from Jesus' example of serving and caring for others. Although not directly referencing his or his daughter-in-law's health, his words will be interpreted as a recognition of the difficulties they have faced recently and the role of kindness and support in their journey. Both King Charles and Princess Kate have been touched by the outpouring of well wishes they received after disclosing their cancer diagnosis. The King's message will also indirectly address the harmful impact of online speculation surrounding Kate's health, underscoring the need for compassion and understanding. Described as so proud of the princess for her courage, King Charles maintains close contact with his daughter-in-law. Stepping back from large-scale public duties due to outpatient treatment following his own surgery for an enlarged prostate, the king has gradually resumed his engagements, with reports indicating positive progress in his treatment. While he will not attend the Royal Monday service in person to minimize health risks, he will lead the royal family at the Easter Sunday church service at St. George's Chapel, Windsor, marking his first major event since his cancer diagnosis. The Royal Monday service, a long-standing tradition, typically involves the monarch presenting specially minted coins to individuals recognized for their community service. This year, 75 women and 75 men, symbolizing the king's age, will receive Monday money purses. Despite the ceremony's historical significance, anti-monarchy group Republic plans to stage a protest outside Worcester Cathedral.